listeners so again i'm here with the words composition and this is the second poem of your book honey sickle the kite by harry ben so have you ever seen a flying kite or have you ever tried to fly one it looks wonderful in the bright sky so here also through this word picture the poet actually wants to draw the attention of the reader towards the movement of the kite and actually he wants to persuade the readers that they should also have tried once and they should just notice the beautiful movements of the kite in the beautiful blue sky so first of all i will read this poem to you how bright on the blue is a kite when it's new with a dive and a dip it snaps its tail then soars like a ship with only a sail as over tides of wind it rides climbs to the crest of a gust and pulls then seems to rest as wind falls when string goes slack you wind it back and run until a new breeze blows and its wings fill and up it goes how bright on the blue is a kite when it's new but a regular thing you never will see when it flaps on a string in the top of a tree so in the very first stanza the poet is saying that a new kite looks beautiful in the clear sky in the blue sky when there is no cloud it looks beautiful with a dive and a dip it's diving it's dipping showing its different movements and it looks beautiful with its vibrant colors it snaps its tail it snaps its tail it moves its tail here and there it's enjoy it's flying then soars like a ship with only a sail and it soars it grows up in the sky like a ship raised up on the crest of the waves it goes high up in the air as over tides of wind it rides and it's enjoy it's riding over the wind it looks beautiful further the poet says climbs to the crest of a gust and pull we pull it we gust it and like these only it goes up it reaches to the top then seems to rest as wind falls it goes up when the wind is fast and as the wind falls it also seems that the kite is also taking rest its movements becomes slow when string goes slack you wind it back when the string string means the thread it goes slack it start losing so you start just winding the thread back and run until a new breeze blows and we used to continue with that only until a new breeze start blowing we have to wait for the wind we had to wait for the breeze then only our kite will go up in the air in the vibrant blue further the poet is saying and its wings fill and up it goes and as the wings of the kite fills with the cool breeze it start going up its enjoyment not only for whom who is flying the kite but for the kite itself how bright on the blue is a kite when it's new it looks wonderful it's look beautiful colorful in the dark blue sky but a regular thing regular thing means torn thing tattered what is that that regular thing is 
the kite itself when it stuck somewhere in the tree. But a regular thing you never will see when it flaps on a string in the top of a tree. When you see a regular kite, a torn kite, somewhere flapping in the tree branch only, it doesn't look nice. So here poet has used many kinds of symbols and here the poet is saying that just he's showing a colorful picture with the nature and the enjoyment of the uh, actually the kite and the person who is flying the kite he is not only enjoying the color of the kite only the color of the nature only but he is also enjoying the different movements of the kite it's all about the enjoyment the poet has drawn through this small poem